Now, within a week from today, a week from today, we are permanently closing this tree. Permanently. So that we can give these people enough time to do work. Because now we are not only going to replace what you have seen down there as rotten things, but we are going to replace the top. The whole of the deck is going to be replaced. Uh, so that it is made more safer to avoid those kind of leakages which you have seen down there. We are also going to improve on the safety provision. Like the, what you see then the, uh, along along like a fence along along the, the side of the bridge. We are going to make to put more strong materials to ensure that if tomorrow you fear off, God forbid, if you fear off, then you, you just bounce off and bounce back instead of hitting and going down. So because you know how many trucks have gone down here. So we are going to avoid that by improving those safety problems. We are also going to put light on the grid so that people cannot say I didn't see. I didn't know. Maybe some people may be using the road for the first time. So we are going to put uh, light. In. We are going to improve on the approaches a bit, not so much. Um, I want to maybe create a clear in some of the, 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 the approaches and also put in better signage as we approach the bridge. So what we are going to require now is the cooperation of everybody. Because this is a safety issue. It's not about politics. It's not about anything. Please, I would require, I would call upon everybody to not bring in politics in this matter. This is a safety issue. And all of us, we are must be concerned. One time I got a letter from the LOC one here, the LOC chairman, and was saying, my people are now poor. Open the bridge so that they get money. But how can we open the bridge? for people to die because they have to get money. So let's be patient. What's our target? Our target is that from now, when we close on Monday, we give ourselves part of the remaining week of, uh, of September, October, November, and two weeks in December. We want our target to ensure that by Christmas, and the Christmas holidays come in, the bridge is open so that the people can go and enjoy their food. That's our target. Yeah, I've told you a week now, three months, a week from the, uh, on September, the full month of October, the full month of uh, November, and the two weeks in the December. So those are three complete months. Now, people traveling from uh, the north are not going there. What we have done now is to put a second ferry on Masindi crossing so that we can manage the traffic. We hope that that will improve and also the approach route, the approach road is going to be improved. It's going to be worked on uh, to ensure that uh, the, uh, what has been happening with vehicles getting stuck there will not happen again. So this is what we are going to do here. I'm going to Masindi to see what they are doing. In terms of improving movement of that house. So please, everybody uh, who minds about people's life, this is a safety matter. Yes, so let's be cooperative. Let's cooperate. We don't want people to come here and start demonstrating. We want the bridge tomorrow. No, 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 no. Let's take time and do it well. This is a structure. Okay. As a delicate structure, that. We can't just gamble. Thank you very much. In Uganda, in Uganda. Uh, they don't say one, no?